Hi everyone, this is an unusual sight to see, nothing there, where we've usually got bin, 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 after bin there, for wire and all that sort of thing. Got the little car in here, with this one we're going to be uh, putting it back together, the motor in it's not real happy, uh, you can wind the key and it just goes, winds over and gets no compression. So we sort of pulled out a motor out of another one. We had three of these, so the motor's sitting there at the moment. Uh, spare seats, so I'm going to put one of those in the one night that I drive around. But anyway, we've been busy stripping wire today, getting all the casings off, uh, so we can do a scrap run. So we've got it all loaded. Got it all loaded all up. We have, if I can have a bow peep in here, Yes, our number one stripped wire there. He will have a better look that way. Um, I've got to find out about this one here. It's been stripped, it's stripped wire, but yeah, I'll show you what I'm talking about. Um, if I get down there, it's been the wire has been stripped, but it's dark, so it looks like it's been hot and that sort of thing. I've got to find out whether I can get number one for that because we've stripped it. Hasn't got no coating resin or anything on it. Um, we've got our number one insulated right there. Better known as extension cords. Uh, but see, we've got extension cords in that and, and a few other things like from washing machines and that sort of thing. Got our copper sitting here. Got a whole heap of it. Um, we're putting everything through. We're not leaving nothing here. We've got our number two copper in there. I can't open it because the strap's on there. Uh, we're taking our stainless as well. What we've got so far, we've got a whole heap of batteries. There's about two stacks high and a full pallet sitting there underneath all of this. So there's about four of these big Volvo batteries, that sort of thing. They're a 12 volt battery, massive heavy things. Um, we've got Christmas lights here as well, uh, somewhere. <laughs> Very, they're in here somewhere. Oh, there they are down there. Um, this one here is all phone cords, uh, like your USB phone chargers off without the ends on them. Um, this over here, uh, where are we, where are we? This one here is that funny wire I did ask about. Um, I'm still going to take it. It's got a silver coating on it. Oh, there's one with a copper on it. So it might, be, yeah, that's got a copper on that one. Oh, well, we might be able to stick that in that. It's only one wire. Ah, not going to worry. <laughs> it's not going to make any difference, is it? One little strand. Um, but yeah, stainless, like I said, we've got a cat wire in the bin there. We've got, uh, oh, I don't know what else we've got up in here. I can't remember. can't remember what's up in that one. Let me have a dig, everyone. Let me have a diggy rig. None of this is tied down. I don't think it needs to be tied down. Oh, we've got our ballasts and transformers there. What have we got up there? Oh, motors. Motors up in that tin drum. I'm going to bring that tin drum back because I want it back. And more, more batteries down there, like I was saying. Um, but this is a little car. We chopped her in half. <laughs> Damn. We really chopped it in half. Got two with the grinder. Poor old thing. Never mind. It did have, this one had a prang. Hit a tree, so it was disrepairable. It was classed as a write-off. So we pulled the motor out, pulled the front end out of it, pulled the axle out, and uh, yeah, so hopefully we get $200 for that. Let's hope so. But anyway, um, yeah, let's get going and get to the scrapyard, I suppose. It's 
Start your eyes. What's the heaviest part of the top Ah, uh, well, I reckon if you go in there and go under the, the steering column, that's just my bet. Because I had the strap around here and around the windscreen right there. So even if you articulate your fork, you can do it that way. Yeah, yeah, you gotta come this way with your fork. Go that way now, swinging around. Turn your fork more. Turn your, rotate your fork. And go up a little bit. And go in. Straight in there. Keep going. Tilt it back a bit. Go right in. That way you catch the other side. That's it. Tilt it back. Yeah, go up. It'll want to do this, which is only natural. You got the main part of it anyway. You got it. Yep, you got it. Should be able to go back now. Yep, yep. You're all clear. Nah, that, that's only the old throttle cable. Straight back. Bye bye car. Alright, oh, pick your other strap up. Put him in the front. I don't know where he's putting it. The excavator's broke. So they gotta put everything on the ground. Bit of a bummer for him, but anyway. Usually they put it straight in the bin. I suppose it could be untying all this, eh? Hey? Get all this done. To... Huh? Oh, go anywhere, mate. Go anywhere. Tilt your fork down so you get in underneath the, the whole thing. Oh, yeah, fair enough.
Friday night. Keep going. Keep going. You're under it. Very heavy car at all. Go back down and tilt your fork this way. Right. Tilt your fork this way and go down and get a bit further on. There you are, where you go. Gotta lose it. Oh, you got the rod down there. You gotta, you have to lift, go back down and lift higher. I'll push it back on for you. Now go higher. You got a suspension right underneath. They caught onto the side rail. Yeah, that'll do you. Oh, chuck these up the back. Yeah, I that one. That one held our gate together. Alright. Go in the yard, I suppose. I'll go forward when we get the batteries out because they're on a pallet on there. Ah, uh, winter, same as the season. Tim, Tim, T I M. Yep, that's the one. What do you want to start with? Let's do this one. Well, that's bright. That's been stripped, so it'd be bright, wouldn't it? Yeah. Yep. Yeah, number one. Yep. No, it's very good. Strip one. No price change from yesterday. What did you get last time? I didn't have any. This is the first time I brought it in. Ten dollars sixty a kilo. Oh, that's all right. Mm. Damn good. So, not so where do you want to put that? Hang on, yeah, that's the thing. Fifty-four. Yeah, then we'll tip it all the way to we. Yeah, that's it. Oh, yeah, it could be. So. Where are we going with it, bro? A lot easier in the wheelie bin, eh? Straight in there. 
Give me knees. Want the strands? <laughs> it's not going to weigh much, is it? No. Just better off pouring it in. Hold the rubbish with it. Uh, it weigh, a lot more tape in the bin than what, what there was. Then mana. Ten kilo. Burnt. Oh, burnt. Burnt. Yep. <sighs> Six kilo. We're going to weigh a bin too. That's not too bad either. Seven dollars yeah. thirty a kilo. Mm. Yeah, so it's worth it. Yeah. It is. Oh, you're kidding! Damn. <laughs> no, I do every little bit I can, but when you get down to that extension cord, it's not worth it. So what's that? The, the extent, no. yeah. It's not worth it. I reckon that's two kilo. That was a good guess. <laughs> two kilo. Hang on. Twenty nine dollars twenty out of that. Huh. Pretty good. Finished with that one. Now we've got that insulated stuff. Oh yeah. So you get I think three bucks thirty a kilo for this. Oh yep. Putting in the center for you. No wonder it was heavy. You yeah, about 10, 10 or 15 kilos for the bloody bin. Three bucks a kilo, yes. Oh, that's not too bad. Three dollars a kilo. All right, where are we going with this one? Back over the other side of the shed again. It's all the oh, yeah. The next one we'll probably have to use a forklift because <laughs> it's heavier. The next one. Uh, it's been stripped out number two, I reckon it's number two. I don't know what you class it as, but it's been transformers and stuff like that. Jesus Christ. I don't think we'll both lift that. Yeah, we'll do the rest if you like. Oh, you got to weigh that, haven't you? Yeah, but I can go back to do it. All right. But I reckon that's about 12, 13 kilos for that bin. Because I've got another one the same. Oh, the woman coming in, her mother was a hoarder. Yeah. She had 90 kilos of the... Yeah, yeah, the other fellow was saying. Yeah. yeah, now, this stuff here, I've asked on the web and everything like that, that's a copper one. Yeah. That shouldn't be in there. Don't know what it's doing in there, but this is that silver coated stuff. So is it 50 50? Just goes through as the same as the other stuff. Oh, so we can weigh it with it? Yeah, 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 yeah. I didn't know. So we'll, do is we'll put it on there. I'll yep. add it and then we'll tear the two bins off together. Yeah, do that then. Because I wasn't sure. Well, that saves me having an extra it bin. Go, it just goes through as low grade. All right. Yeah, not high grade. Yep, yep, yep. Just leave that one there. Um, keep going with the wire. That stuff. It's about little motors and all that sort of thing. What would you class it as? Uh, I class it as number two because it's being it's got the resin and everything right too. Yeah, but see the resin's no good. So you just go through a seven dollars thirty again. Oh yeah. Yeah. Same price. Yeah. As the, the 
So I could mix it with it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Because see how you got like your windings? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yep. they're lacquered? Yep. It just, yeah, it just goes through as a domestic way. Oh, right. All still, right. Still good money. Yeah. Just not as good as you got for the strip stuff. Yep. And it's better than getting $3 a kilo. Like oh, that. shit, yeah. What, so I'm doing the right thing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <sighs> Probably about 80 odd kilos in this thing. Which way you want to go? That'll do, won't it? Damn. I'm definitely not going to lift that. <laughs> 50 kilos each. Three and five, was it? Sorry, mate, was it? This one. Oh, you, you're redoing really no, it, aren't you? The other one. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Seven dollars thirty. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Hundred and four. Don't rush. What we might do is I might get the fork and we might I split them two and put it into that. We'll put that one into that and then we'll put the PVC and that ever. Say lifting up the fork, I can just we can just tip them into them because they're low. Whatever you want to do. Yeah, we'll do that. It's up to you. You know. You're doing the runnings around here, not me. <laughs> Move this out of the road. Still on the wire. Networking cable been stripped. The casing's off. Got copper inside. Same shit. Yeah. Ah. So I'm keeping it separate for nothing. <laughs> uh, the last like the little bit. So anything with a PVC. Then the light stuff just yeah. goes through the low grade. Oh yeah. But like it's good you've got no plugs on it because plugs... Yeah, I take them all off because plugs, plugs takes the price down. Plugs, plugs cost you over a dollar a kilo. Um... So I could be bringing the plugs in too, could I? Nah, nah, leave the plugs off. Oh yeah. So like... I'm talking about separate. No, you see all these, all, anything with PVC coated on it. Yeah. Even though you stripped it one layer off, it's still got it on there. So we, uh, it just goes through as one thing. All a learning curve. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yep. That one we can tip it straight in. Yep. I'll let you do that. I'll take my handle. Don't want you to lose the handle in there. So you'll be weighing those three together, yeah? No, I did this one separate. Oh, yeah. What's that one? This is all phone cords and stuff. I don't think it's is it copper. I'm not sure. No ends on them. Even down to your USB cords. Oh, yeah, we could put that through with the other stuff. If I don't bring it over and find out, I don't know. That's weighing nothing. There you go. I did weigh two, only because I pressed on it. See, chuck, chuck that. Chuck that one in there too. This one. Well, um, I've got Christmas lights here too. Would that go the same? What's that? Christmas lights. It's got the bulbs and stuff in it still. Nah, I don't want them. You don't want them? The bulbs are weigh more than the, the, the wire. Oh yeah, because it's all this stuff. Yeah, I don't want it. You don't want it? Take it home? Yeah, come. The plastic weighs more than the copper. Yep, sweet. Understand? I want to sit there and buckle <laughs> the
And it's still don't weigh nothing. Oh, I gotta get that one out. We don't get nothing for that one. Home. Transformers and uh, ballasts. I'm glad you see just stick it on there. It's <laughs> got some weight in it. <laughs> I think I just done the bum in it. Oh, no. I used the trolley to put it on. <laughs> 84 kilos. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay, where are we going with this one? Okay, you need a barrel. <laughs> I've got a trolley. Yeah, that's the go. Because that's how I put it on. Somewhere. Somewhere. Oh, we can sort it out after anyway. Zero. No, just we can it. Take it off. Yeah. Yeah, two, nothing. <laughs> don't, weigh. <laughs> don't weigh nothing. Hey, they're the ones to bring, but the bums don't hold. Right, do this one at the same time. Yep. There you go. So that goes in the same. Oh yeah. yeah Got your barrel Are we heading with this one? In there, electric motor. Geez, that's fairly high. Higher than last week, didn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I'm only a piddly little thing. Oh yeah. Up we go. Hang on, you got me heart. Sorry. <clears throat> she don't weigh that now. Four kilos. All right. All right, we'll get into the stainless. A bit there, another piece here. Now I've got a bin here. Yeah, I've got a bin full of stainless. I think that's 
a lot. That's a lot. This one's got uh, 304 stainless written on it. Well, it did have. That's the other half. Yeah, right. <laughs> so she's pretty high grade. 34 kilos there. Kilo for that stuff oh geez that's going back a fair while that's going back two or three months so 46, because that keeps a record of how many times it's been here too doesn't it this one doesn't the other, the other ah one. yeah yeah, yeah sweet as um so where are we going back over this way yeah up the front there yeah i'll get used to the place soon enough Yep. That's that. Jeez, that's two pieces of lunch. Four kilos. <sighs> and it's stupid the scale of how they could put it on there and it's still two kilo. And the other ones don't weigh nothing. Bloody unreal, isn't it? Yeah, we'll just chuck them together. Now we'll, you've done all that. We'll, we'll go to the copper. I'll get the old, the old light fixture off. I just want to know how much this light, light which fixture. It's all copper, two, two kilos. kilos just for that. She's an old one. I even get the scratch test. Now, before we go on, does this go as a radiator? Because it's all copper. No, no, we just put it through copper. Sweet as. You got no fittings or anything on them? Just solder? Just soldered. Yeah. Like that. Yeah, yeah. And a bit of paint. Number two. Well, we'll try and recover. Hello. It's not bright. No. It's all been used. Yeah. That's what I thought it goes as. And then with solder on goes as number two. Yeah. 76 kilos. I think the drum's about four kilos. $9.10 per kilo. And barra. I did have it in the steel drum, but I took it out because it wasn't fitting in the steel drum. Lead the way. Might be best to pluck some of it out. Yeah, better, yeah. Like that heavy thing for a one. No, next one. Next, next one? Yes, no. Oh, so we're going in here, are we? Yeah. All right, not that one. Oh, I can't get that one out.
Josh, he's copper. Yeah. <laughs> I test everything with the grinder. We may be able to lift it. Is it out your way? You got it. That's it. One more piece here hanging. That's it. Now we've only got the batteries, um, so you want to sort out that wire first, or you want to do the batteries, it's up to you. No, we might sort the wire out. Because I can move out of the road if you need to get to these bins. All right. Yeah. Go in. Go down. You're going to rotate your fork a little bit. Right, just rotate your fork the other way. That's it. Now go in. Because it was touching the top here. Just go in now. Mickey Mouse, mate. She's all good. I put that small one in here. There we go. Kilo. You got to edit, haven't you? Except and close. Twelve kilos. <laughs> oh, Jesus, this is the hundred odd kilo.
push on the handle. Isn't it good at stasis one? Isn't it good at stasis one? <laughs> Oh, we got 10 kilos, so it's 2 kilo for the small one. Uh, what, with this in the road? Hey. No, 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 I'll just go forward. <laughs> I was going to say. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just move these out of the road. Nah, you might have. You got a, You haven't got no straps. Oh yeah, you'll reach. Keep going. You only got about four inches here. And you got about a foot back there. Down. Go down. Down, 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 down. Keep going down. Keep going down, keep going down, now go in. Come in. Oh, here. See how you go if you lift it up a bit and... See how you go dragging it back. Nah, too slippery. Uh, I'll grab one of my straps. I'm gonna hook it around your fork and drag it out. Yeah, come forward. Nah, you're right. Give that a go. Keep going. Keep going. Go down. And you're going to come across this way too. A fair bit. You need a side shifter. Very limited. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, your forks are too wide anyway. I'll bring that one over. All right now, yeah, keep going the way you are and go down. Now left hand down. Well, I've got to put the fork closer. It's a very narrow one, that one. Oh yeah, you got that there. Um, yeah, go in there. Keep going. It's all yours, you're in there. Till the back. Till the back more. You got it. That's it. About half a ton. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you got 
<laughs> well, with all the other stuff, yes. yes. <laughs> How much are we going to get for the batteries? You're on a negative two, you want me to zero it out? Uh, yeah. There you go. Straight down there. Seven hundred and thirty-four kilos. Yeah, we'll take twenty-five for the That's only a plastic one. We still take twenty-five. Oh, okay. The battery mob because we don't swap them. That's what they just hit us with. Oh, fair enough. Yep. 40, no, that's fine. Forty kilos for a fucking jet one. <laughs> I thought it'd bring a plastic one, make it a bit different. <laughs> Apparently not. Oh. Hang on. I think the trailer was overloaded. <laughs> wow. Mmm, I noticed that. It feels good when you can come home, enjoy a good beer, after a hard day at the scrapyard. Tell you what, let's get into the numbers. Right, our copper wire stripped. It was 44 kilos, don't worry about that 54, because that's with uh, the wheelie bin. Uh, the 44 kilos, so it's $10.60, uh, $466.40, uh, copper wire domestic tank, etc. That is the burnt wire, uh, so it'll be four, four kilos, that's why it's so low. $7.30 uh, a kilo, $29.20. Now we come down to our PVC copper wire, that's the wire that's coated. It was uh, with the wheelie bin, 106 kilos, 94 kilos in total without the, without the bin. Uh, so it's three dollars and five cents per kilo. Total cost of two hundred and eighty-six dollars seventy. And we come down to copper domestic tank again. Now that's the same as um, the stripped copper wire that was actually burnt. Uh, it was 94 kilos. That's, that was all the uh, electric transformers, copper transformers, that sort of thing. $7.30. So we got a grand total there of $686.20. Uh, copper wire PVC again. This is the one that I wasn't sure on. Uh, the black bin. It was the one with all the 50-50 copper wire. So we had 11 kilos in that. Uh, he said we could probably put it in with the other one up further because it's the same price, all that sort of thing. Three dollars and five cents. Uh, that one was thirty-three dollars and fifty-five. Uh, our fridge compressors and electric ballasts. Um, we didn't have any fridge compressors, but we had electric ballast, which was eighty-four kilos, fifty cents a kilo, forty-two dollars neat. Uh, next one, copper electric motors. That was all of our motors that we had, 70 kilos, the drum weighed 4 kilos, 80 cents a kilo, $56 neat. Now we go down to our stainless alloy solid, uh, I did take some of that, 32 kilos, 40 cents a kilo, $12.80. Now we come down to number 2 copper, this is our copper piping, all that sort of thing with the solder and everything on it, that was 68 kilos. That was a heavy drum, that one. That's, yeah, almost 10 kilos. Not quite. 8 kilos. Uh, $9.10, uh, $9 sorry. $9.60. 
So that's a grand total of for the copper number two, six hundred and eighteen dollars eighty. And we come down to our batteries, automotive batteries. We had a grand total. This is the heaviest of them all. Seven hundred and nine kilos. Fifty dollars fifty cents a kilo. I wish it was fifty dollars a kilo. Damn, we bring home the money now. Uh so that was uh three hundred and fifty four dollars fifty. Uh then we come down to our car body. Um, that wasn't in the last clip or anything of that, but, um, yeah, we only got a hundred dollars for our poor old car body. I thought I was going to get, um, 200 bucks, but no, we didn't. We only got a hundred dollars, but in a grand total of 200 and I, I should say 2000, I'll rephrase it, $2,686 and 15 cents, as you can see on the screen. So I like those figures. We'll definitely be trying to do some more uh, street scrapping. Hopefully pick up on what that sort of thing. Curbsides and that sort of thing. I have found a little honey hole with wire and all that sort of thing. But, you know, I'm at home at the moment. Um, trying to enjoy a good beer. Just about finished, actually. Um, so, yeah, if you've come this far in this video, don't forget to... Like and subscribe, and if you wish to subscribe, don't forget to hit the notification bell. That way you'll get notified when there's a new video coming out. So on that note, everyone, cheers. Have a good day.